got it. Oh, 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 I got it. <laughs> Not a good start. <laughs> What's up, guys? It's Brandon J, and today I'm gonna be diving with the one and only Jacobson. What's up, guys? We're gonna be diving out here today. We're actually making separate videos. Uh, Jake, this whole ride down here, we drove down here together today, and this whole ride, he's like, Brandon, I got something I wanna show you. I'm so excited about it. Knowing Jake, it could be something absolutely epic or it could be something just terrible. Ready, Brandon? I'm ready, dude. This is awesome, man. We no longer have to bring water bottles down here. Uh-oh. Check it out. What do you got? I got what a live that? straw. So basically, oh! you can drink out of the river. That's legit. Are you gonna do it? I'm gonna try it out, but Let's I, see it. I'm a little nervous. Come on, you gotta do it, bro. Right. <laughs> this water is so gross. I can't believe you're doing this right now. I think people can actually drink out of urinal through this thing. Uh, <laughs> you I'm, gonna I'm test it out? No. <laughs> but I will test this out here. Hold on, here we go, here we go. You're gonna be sick tomorrow, I guarantee it, dude. Can you imagine this spot? It's cold. Here we go. How okay. is it? Dude, there's so many particles right here. <laughs> like there's so much stuff in the water. You already started Honestly, up. like, does it feel clean? It just tastes like water. It just tastes like water? <laughs> yeah. Is it, it? is it Jacobson approved? Uh, we Give me a day and I'll let you know if I approve of this. If you get sick or not? If I'm on the toilet the entire day for the rest of the day, <laughs> I'll let you know. But this is really cool. This is a game changer. Like we no longer have to bring bottles down yeah. here. And uh, yeah, like, there's some sand here. So anytime I, anytime I go fishing, I can bring that? You could. That's legit. Yeah. That's I'll awesome, just drink man. out of ponds and Dude, stuff. If you don't have water, you just pee in a bottle, Brandon? That's, no, absolutely not. <laughs> yeah, honestly, this is so cool, man. I'm excited about this. And I heard like for every life straw you buy, it actually gives like, they give water out to some people. So that's really cool. It's awesome, dude. All right, so while Jake is out here drinking up all the water in the Chattahoochee River, I'm actually gonna be diving in it today. I'm just gonna be doing a little bit of free diving, just uh, basically gonna make a little river treasure video for you guys before I get on the road. I have a big trip planned down in Florida. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Jacobson, however, is doing a really cool video. You guys can check it out on his channel. And uh, I'll, I'll give you a hint. Can I tell him? Can I tell him, Jake? You can tell him. Okay, Jake is, for the very first time, going to be using a metal detector. This thing's pretty epic. He showed it to me. And he's also going to be scuba diving as well. He's got the scuba set up, so it's going to be legit, dude. And what if you find all kinds of rings? I'm going to be mad. I'm going to be mad that I didn't have a little metal detector. <laughs> it's going to be awesome. Like, supposedly, there's an expensive wedding ring out here. I think it's like $27,000. Like the price. That's unreal. So if I find that's going to be crazy. Yeah. You're going to split the money with me, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, so you pretty much know what's going to be happening today. I'm going to be hanging out with Jake. Jake's going to be making his own little video. I'm going to be making my own little video. The water rises in a few hours, so we don't have a ton of time to dive. But I think we can manage to still find a few things. With that being said, I'm going to put all the gear on. I'm going to go ahead and get in the water and uh, get to swimming. All right, bro. See you.
All right, so really quick dive update. There's good news and bad news. Mostly bad news. <laughs> I will start off with the bad news. So the bad news is the water rose extremely fast. No sirens or anything, it just came up. And also, more bad news is it's literally like chocolate milk now. Yeah. It's, it's, te this it's is, terrible. This is one of the worst I've seen in a long time. So uh, I'm gonna show you guys the water. Oh, the good news is though, we, we have the river board. So at least, at least we'll be able to board. Yeah, we do, we do have some good news. So normally this is like all clear and obviously this is like, this is just dirty. I mean, all this water is, you can't really see through it at all. Also the water is like super high right now, as you can see. So can't really dive in that, but we can surf it. So that'll be fun. I'm just gonna go ahead and go over some of the lures real quick. We didn't find a lot because honestly, I thought I had a lot more time. Uh, than I did today out here. So I'm gonna show you guys some of the finds and then basically we're just gonna hang out and board. We're gonna end the day right. We're going to the actual river walk over here. It's a little bit away from the river, so it'll be a little bit quieter. So we'll be able to review all the stuff. All right, so we had to move to a little bit different spot of the river. It gets really, really loud out here when all the water's moving. It just sounds like crazy static on the camera. So had to move to this back area and uh, hopefully it's not as loud. It's kind of still a little loud, but Anyway, let's go over the finds from today. So we always find a ton of weights, stuff like this, uh, but I've never found one of these. This is a crazy big one. I'm gonna show you guys. This weight right here is actually huge. I'm pretty sure it has a five on it. So I'm assuming maybe it's five ounces. I could be wrong about that. But anyway, this is a giant weight. Found a little bit different style weight. This one's a little bit smaller. It also has a number two on it, which uh, leaves me to believe that this is maybe a two ounce weight. I could be wrong again. Let me know in the comment section found a little bit smaller weights and of course a bunch of fishing line we always find a ton of that stuff we always try to get the fishing line out fish turtles all types of stuff can be entangled in this so it's always good to get the line out it's pretty typical to find weights and hooks so we did find a couple hooks nothing interesting with these hooks but i did find a hook that's pretty interesting it actually has this weird uh thing on the end of it and if you can see here it's actually a like a bag believe it or not so i talked to jake about this and he said uh it's actually cat fishermen take a hook and then take the bait and then wrap it in pantyhose tie it to the hook so it doesn't come off the hook as easy uh, and it makes sense so imagine basically like some type of catfish bait like it's normally really soft gooey stuff it slides off the hook really easy but I guess if you wrap it in pantyhose basically it allows all that scent to seep out into the water so the catfish can find it but it's also rugged so it's gonna stay on the hook it's pretty interesting but Definitely a weird find when I found this. I was like, I don't know what kind of bag is on this. It's definitely strange. The Jake told me that little cat fisherman secret. So pretty cool to you cat fishermen out there. If you're not trying the pantyhose technique, try it and let me know how it works. Or if you guys have tried it before, let me know in the comment section below if it works. I don't really know. Got a few baits here. Gonna start off with this dirty swim bait right here. This thing I'm assuming used to be white. Uh, it's got some white in there, but it is completely black now due to uh, an extensive amount of river slime. So this thing is disgusting. We've got this dirty fluke right here. We've got this even more dirty fluke right here. And lastly, this dirty, flimsy, nasty fluke. The last fishing lure we have of the day is a little spinnerbait. However, it doesn't have any hook or any blades on it. So this thing is uh, it's pretty useless. I mean, you could use it for this. So last but not least, these are some of my favorite finds. They're always the untraditional finds. We always find a lot of lures and stuff you can expect to find in the river, but my personal favorite are like the weird, odd items, just because when you're diving down and you find something odd, you're like, oh, that's surprising. Wasn't expecting that. So here are some of my favorite odd finds. Totally thought this was a skateboard wheel when I first found it. However, it is not skateboard wheel material. It's very, very hard. I have no clue what this is. Uh, it's it's like porcelain or something. So I, I have no idea pretty cool though also found this little key tab I'm not really sure what this went to but uh, it's kind of cool. It's a weird find. I found some phenomenal reading glasses So they're, they're pretty much uh, they make me a whole different level of sexy puts me way up on the sexy scale but these things are uh, they're pretty crusty and I'm pretty sure they're prescription because Well, no, you know what that might be the river slime because everything looks completely different when I put them on. Last but not least, the best find of the day is this knife. And uh, it's, it's pretty cool, it's a really awesome find. I've got uh, actual brand of it as well. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see it on the screen, but it says uh, old timer on there. Anyway, it's an old timer knife. I'm not sure if you guys know that brand or not. I've, I personally don't know the brand that well, but it's a really cool knife. It's very, very rusted. The blade on this thing is trash. The only reason you might cut something with that is because it's just sharp from being so rusted out. 
but this definitely has to be my favorite find of the day. Well, I found Jacobson. He's still working on his videos. Kind of like a behind the scenes. <laughs> it's like a behind the scenes. Hey, you get hey, to, don't look. You get to don't see what look. Jake's working on before he posts it. Oh man, I got super thirsty and Jake just happened to have his live straw. So this is like the worst time to test this out because the water is super, super muddy, but I, I'm so thirsty. I got to drink out of this water. I actually unscrewed the filter. So Brandon is going to have the craps for a solid week. What a great prank. All right, come on, Brad. Well, now that I've stirred up all this stuff here and the water is like dirty, I think it's a perfect time to try out the life straw. <clears throat> oh, it's such a stupid idea. Well, what do you think, Brandon? <laughs> uh, it's okay, it just tastes like water, but I could see stuff that was floating start to go into the straw. Hope this filter works. I really hope this filter works. It was a lot warmer than I was expecting too. Yeah, it really. Did that is. happen to you? Uh huh. I mean, it's not bad, really. I don't think it quenches my thirst. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, I'm done with this. I'm grossed out. I'm grossed well, out. Well, in a winter time when the water's cold, you should be good. Yeah. If this, if this actually works, if I'm not like on the toilet all week next week, or tomorrow or tonight, then <laughs> I'm, I'm buying one. Here we go. You ready to go? I'm ready, dude, but uh, gonna try some surfing, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try it, but I wanna try that first before I get all tired. <laughs> all right, are we good? Yeah, let's do it. You're gonna, you're gonna record me? I'll, yeah, I'll record you. I'll all right. you too. All right, here we go. So just so you guys know a little bit of context to the situation, I normally bodyboard or riverboard, and you can get on your knees, you can do all that good stuff. It's really fun and simple, but surfboard is a whole lot different. It's a whole different game. It's a lot harder. So I'm gonna try the surfboard. It's super, super hard compared to the actual riverboard. I normally can ride in on it okay, but every time I try to stand up, I go nose down, and it sucks getting wiped down this wave. So I'm gonna try it. Jake's an expert at it, but uh, I'm gonna try to do it today. Do I got it? Oh, 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 I got it! I got it! <laughs> Not a good start! Where'd it go? Oh, he wiped out! Dang, that was awesome, man. He just wiped out. <laughs> he went in and just disappeared. Look at him, he's way down there, drifting down the river. But it started bad, it didn't end bad. <laughs> All right, so Brandon just went out there and he wiped out, but it was a valiant effort, man. The water's even rising more right now, which is crazy. The alarm just went off. So this wave should get pretty big. What happened, Brandon? Bro, I, I slipped on the rock, so I didn't even get a good entry. And then I couldn't get out of the freaking stream of current. <laughs> so it took me like a quarter of a mile down river. I had to paddle upstream. I'm going back to the river board. All right. Yeah, we're going to try it round two. Good effort, man. Jake's killing it right now. I cannot do the surfboard thing. Jake, I'm going to come. I'm going to come in. Stay, Jake, stay. All right, so I did much better on the board. Much, much better. I can't surf yet, but I can board. So Jake just went on the surfboard. He did good, but he got taken way, way down river. Yeah, man, that was crazy. The water's rising even more right now, so the wave's getting bigger. I got swept down the entire river. It was fun, though. That's literally one of the hardest things about doing this boarding. Everybody thinks it's like getting in, staying in. That's really easy. The hard part is when you wipe out getting out of the actual current. It's so, so hard. I got these fins right here uh, when we riverboard, but when you surf, you can't wear them because uh, you can't really stand on the surfboard that well. Whew. It's fun out here, though. Brandon's about to hop in with a riverboard. This is crazy, man. The wave's getting so big. A lot of water's moving down the river right now. I guess they're just starting to drain out Lake Oliver, but that's, he's either going to wipe out or it's going to be a pretty cool ride. What? I got to look at this. Look, look, you got to zoom in right here. It's a ladybug. A ladybug? Yeah, it's a ladybug. A ladybug. I got a, I got a ladybug on my, uh, it's got to be good luck. Let's do this thing. <laughs> Let's do it, man. All right, so we got Brandon here. He's ready to go with the riverboard. He's got his little flippers on. The rocks are super slippery. He might slip even before jumping off. You ready? Dude, this is crazy. It's high, bro. 
That wave's so big. Let's go, man. Oh! They let some water go. Corey, look at this, man. Yeah, that wave's getting bigger. Oh! A little doing bunny hops. The Superman. He just did the Superman. Let's go, Brandon. Oh, he's on his knees. No hands. No hands. <laughs> Look how big this thing is. It's stacking out. That thing's getting big. Oh, he's at the top. Oh, he went back down. He wasted it. You wasted it. <laughs> Look at all the water coming down. Oh, wait, he's standing up. Oh, where'd he go? Oh, he wiped out. He's going down. This water's getting big quick. It is, man. Oh, get right a little wave. <laughs> he's actually surfing a little wave behind the big wave. Yeah, bad move. Brandon, that wave got big dude when you're in there. Bro, it's huge right now. I'm out of breath. I'm tired. My wetsuit's hot. <laughs> that was fun though. You that ready to go? You ready to go in there? Yeah, I'm getting in there. Alright bro, it's your turn. Alright guys, so I had a lot of fun. I am completely out of breath. I'm exhausted. Had a lot of fun out here today. Had a great time river treasure diving. Water came up, we made the best of it, cut our dive a little short, but came out here, had a good time boarding. If you guys enjoyed watching the boarding and kind of the vlogging process, I know it wasn't too long, but just wanted to share that with you guys. If you guys enjoy it, make sure you let me know in the comment section below. I might do some videos specifically for river boarding and you know, all of us hanging out. We normally have the whole crew out here and we normally don't put that on the videos. I don't know why, so I might start doing that if that's something you guys wanna see. If you enjoyed this video, Leave a big old thumbs up as always. I know you can hear I'm out of breath. I'm very tired. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out. Oh, I got it. Oh, 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 I got it. Not a good start. <laughs>